Hey you, yeah you, do you like Cartoon Fight Club and want to start your own fighting series? Scratch that. Do you hate Cartoon Fight Club and want to make an even better series? Well you came to the right place, because thanks to my sponsors at Filmora, I am going to be teaching you how to edit and create your own versus videos. Now, I will not be teaching you how to research or animate characters. Trust me, you don't want animation advice from me. Really, you don't. But what I am good enough to teach is how to edit the videos. But before you learn how, you gotta learn what. So I'm going to quickly run through the Filmora specs. This thing is pre-equipped with over 300 video effects, 140 filters, plenty of text and title options, motion elements, and a whole entire authentic music library for you to use during your editing process. Filmora also supports Mac and Windows, 4K support, green screen, reverse playback, picture in picture, and import directly from social media. Now with all that out of the way, let's begin. The first thing we gotta do is import media. You can get media from downloading clips and saving images off the internet. Once you gather all of your findings for your characters, you can easily and swiftly drag and drop your images in the order of which you want them to appear. Once you have the image you want, you can add some important text. Head on over to the text tab and choose Icon Subtitle 3. That's my favorite, but you can choose whatever you want. With this, you can now display facts about the characters on the right side of your screen. Now we all know nobody just wants to read words, and that left side of your screen is looking kinda empty. So to add media clips or images onto the left side of your screen, all you gotta do is quickly drag and drop the image onto the image layer of your video timeline. Once you got all that done for your first character, the process is pretty much wash, rinse, repeat. You can add more facts and info on your left, and add more images and clips on your right, depending on how much you want to show. So once you have the character intros out of the way, you can add the cool transition that will lead you into the fight. So go back to the text tab and choose a cool opener text to open the fight for the viewer. And after that, you can easily drag and drop your completed animation and display the fight right on your timeline. The post analysis is edited pretty much in the same way as the pre-analysis. And once you have everything all neat and in place, you can add in your commentary. Obviously your commentary script should be written before you even begin editing. Research and deciding a winner should be the very first step, then you can go on to starting your animation and finally your video editing. When everything is looking all fine and dandy, head on over to the export button and export your work of art. There are plenty of great rendering options, lots of great HD choices, and once you choose the settings you want, your final step is to quickly hang tight and watch the export bar reach 100%. And BAM! You got yourself a fully edited versus video. To download Filmora, all you gotta do is click the links below. Those links take you to the Filmora site and when you get there, be sure to choose the version to best fit your computer. Whether you got a PC or a Mac, Filmora works on both types. So what are you waiting for? Click the links below. Also, stay tuned because Shadow vs Deadpool should be uploaded within the next few days, so watch out for that battle as well. I'm Animation Rewind, and I'll fast forward to you later.